Praise the Lord, sisters and brothers in Jesus Christ. Praise the Lord. 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 Hallelujah. 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 Psalm 34 1 tells us, I will extol the Lord at all times. His praise will always be on my lips. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 So let's just lift up our hands and praise and thank this great, big, and wonderful God of ours for bringing us today, for taking care of us, for being with us throughout the week and blessing us and bringing us your one again to praise Him, to thank Him, to glorify His name. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 Let's Hallelujah. just lift up our hands and praise Him and thank Him. Hallelujah. 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 We praise you, Lord. We thank you, Lord. We glorify your name, Lord. We lift your name on high, Lord. For you alone are holy. You alone are worthy of all praise, of all glory, of all honor. Hallelujah. 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 We praise you, Lord. We thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. You are the Alpha. You are the Omega. You are the beginning. You are the end. Hallelujah. We praise you, Lord. We thank you, Lord. We give you glory, Lord. We give you honor, Lord, for taking care of us, for being with us, for guarding us, for protecting us, for keeping us safe and sound. We praise you and we thank you, Heavenly Father, for being with us at all times. Hallelujah. 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 Praise you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Praise you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Amen to your name, Lord Jesus. We all believe that Jesus loves us. Amen. 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 Do you believe that Jesus loves us? Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And because He loves us, He does great and wonderful things for us. Amen. Amen. I'm sure we must have done many things in our lives that we didn't expect to happen. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 And why He does all these things for us? Because He is able to do everything. He is our creator. He is our maker. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The book of Ephesians tells us, Ephesians 3.20, to him who is able to do immeasurably more than all we ask or imagine. Amen. Amen. Our Heavenly Father, His Son, our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, and His Holy Spirit can do anything and everything. He is able to do everything. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He does things for us because He is mighty. He is an omnipotent God. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Do you Hallelujah. believe He is mighty? Uh, that was a very mild yes. I want to hear from you. Do, do you believe that He is mighty? Let this hall resound, even though we are few in number. Let this hall resound by saying a mighty yes. Do you feel he is mighty? Yes. Do you believe he is mighty? Yes. Hallelujah. 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 And he is faithful. He is faithful because he fulfilled all the promises that he gave to his servants that he gave to his children, Abraham, Isaac, Israel, and all the prophets. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 With his mighty hand, he brought them out of Egypt. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He did great and wonderful things, for he is faithful. Do you believe faithful? Yes. Do you believe he is faithful? Yes. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And he is faithful because he sent his one and only begotten Son, our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, that whosoever believes in him shall not perish, perish but have Eternal life. Eternal life. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 So let's just lift up our hands and praise Him for He is able. He is mighty.
mighty and he is faithful. Hallelujah. 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 Oh, we praise you, Lord. We thank you, Lord. We glorify your name, Lord, for your son, Jesus Christ, to whom we are blessed with salvation. We praise you and we thank you, Lord. We glorify your name, Lord. We magnify your name, Lord. We lift your name on high, Lord. Hallelujah. 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 Oh, we praise you, Lord. We thank you. Lord. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. It's your Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Psalm 121, 4 tells us, Our God never sleeps or slumbers. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. When he brought the Israelites, out of the land of Egypt he took care of them throughout the day and did he tell them okay I'm tired I'll go and sleep in the night and come back again and take care of y'all you take care of y'all throughout the night did he say that or did he take care of them in the night and say I'll come back in, and he, in the morning he told them I'll come back again in the night did he say that but what did he do? He was with them all the time. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. He was with them all the time. And the Bible tells us he was with them in a pillar of fire by night and in a pillar of cloud by day. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 When Daniel was thrown into the lion's den, who was there in that lion's den with Daniel to shut the mouths of the lions? Who was there with them? It was our Heavenly Father. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 Our God never sleeps. He never slumbers. He's always awake, taking care of not only them, but all of us. Amen. Amen. Do you believe that He's taking care of all of us at all the times? Yes. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 In Philippi, when Paul and Silas were in prison, and when they were praying in the night, who shook the earth, the prison? Who broke the chains? It was our Almighty Father. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So our God is able. Do you believe he is able? Yes. Our God is mighty. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Our God is faithful. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And our God never sleeps. He never slumbers. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Do you believe? So let's say it all together. Our God is able. Our God is able. Our God is mighty. Our God is mighty. Our God is faithful. Our God is faithful. He never sleeps. He never sleeps. He never slumbers. He never slumbers. He never ties. He never ties. Of hearing our prayer. Hearing Hallelujah. Our prayer. Hallelujah. Let's say it one more time. Our God is able. Our God is able. Our God is mighty. Our God is mighty. Our God is faithful. Our God is faithful. He never sleeps. He never sleeps. He never slumbers. He never slumbers. He never tires. He never tires. Of hearing our prayer. Of hearing our prayer. Our God is able. God is able. Let's all lift up our hands and say it. Our God is able. Our God is able. Our God is mighty. Our God is mighty. Our God is faithful. Our God is faithful. He never tires. He never tires. Of hearing our prayer. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Let's sing it along and say, Our God is able. Our God is able. Our God is mighty. Our God, our God is faithful. God is he never sleeps. He never, sleeps. He never slumbers. He never, slumbers. He never, tires, he never tires of hearing our prayer. He never sleeps, he never slumbers, 
He never tires of hearing our prayer. When we are weak, He becomes stronger. So rest in His love, cast all of your cares on Him. When you pray every day, that you know how to pray. Remember the Lord will hear, and the answer is on its way. Our God is able, He is mighty, He is faithful. He never sleeps, He never slumbers, He never tires, he never tires of hearing our prayer. When we are weak, He becomes he stronger. Becomes stronger. So rest in His love, cast all of your cares on Him. So rest in His love, cast all of your cares on Him. So rest in His love, cast all of your cares on Him. Hallelujah. Oh, we praise you, Lord. We thank you, Lord. We give you glory and honor and praise, Lord, for you alone are holy and worthy. Let's all lift up our hands and praise Him and thank Him. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Oh, we praise you, Lord. We thank you, Lord. For you alone are the Alpha and the Omega. You never sleep. You never slumber, Lord. You are able. You are mighty. You are holy. You are faithful, Lord. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Oh, we praise you, Lord. We thank you, Lord. We glorify and we magnify your name, Lord. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Let's lift up our voice and praise him and thank him. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. We praise you, Lord. We thank you, Lord. We give you glory and honor and praise, Lord. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. In the year two, in the year 2021, uh, I, my company closed down and we had a difficult time. But God is able, He is mighty, and He is faithful. He never sleeps, He never slumbers. And throughout that year, and the next year as well, I didn't have a job. But He took care of everything, for He never sleeps. He never slumbers and I'm sure every one year may be going through some thing or the other and I'm sure he is able and he is mighty to do everything. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 So let's all sing this hymn once again and believe in our hearts that he is able, he is mighty, he is faithful and he never sleeps, he never slumbers, he never tires of hearing our prayer. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He never sleeps, he never slumbers, he never tires of hearing our prayer. When we are weak, he becomes, he stronger. becomes stronger. So rest, so rest in his love and cast all, all of your cares, cares on him. So rest in His love, cast all of your cares on Him. So rest in His love, cast all of your cares on Him. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Father Muthu is here. Welcome to your Father and uh, to preach the Word of God. And, uh, Father is a wonderful preaching today, on the, especially on the healing part of it. And I'm sure it's going to touch everyone. Let's say a small one, Hail Mary for Father, anointing upon the word today. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are the amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Lord be the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit as the beginning is now, whatever I shall be, world without an name. Over to Father. Yes, Father. Please remain seated. Dear friends, the topic that is chosen is You Are Healed. Under the title, we would like to have a sharing. And, uh, you know, in today's first reading, how God invited Abraham to leave everything, his relatives, his property, and everything of him that belongs to him. Anything that belongs to me, belongs to you, it's not that easy to detach. And hesitation will be there. First and foremost, the hesitation will be the stumbling block for us to live and then detach and then get, accept the mission that is entrusted to us. Same thing happened to Abraham today in today's first reading. It was the case with most of the prophets in the Old Testament background. Saying this, what I want to tell you is, it's a case with me as well. <laughs> Every time when Brother Alfred asked me to give a message, I say, okay. And then the hesitation comes. What is the topic to choose? How to present the topic? And am I worthy to do that? Do I have the courage to do that? And then later, okay, like the prophets. Of course, in the hands of God, we are, we are simple matter. When we trust in the Lord, you see now, but said just to pray one Hail Mary for Father. Definitely, the prayer will bring, I was wondering how to begin. When you said one Hail Mary, without any hesitation, I just started. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. You are healed. First and foremost, if there is something, why you need a healing, there should be something. Either there is a wound, definitely there must be a wound. Only then you seek for healing. Yes or no? Yes, Father. All right. Now we have to reflect more and more about the wounds. What sort of wounds? How the wound is created in a human person? Where is the source? What is the background when someone is wounded? And then, afterwards you seek after the resources for healing the wounds. Any human being, human person, either you or me, the basic thing that we need to understand is that you and the mind, I and the mind, The mind always has two elements. One is positive and negative elements. Very carefully you notice, this is a basic thing for everything. The mind has positive and negative. To put it in a way, in the world, there is evil. There is goodness and there is evil. Yes or no? There is evil and there is goodness. In each person, the mind has both matter. What are those both? Positive and negative elements. It is up to the mind to choose either the positive element or the negative element. Positive strength or negative element. Mostly what happens with us is we mix up you and the mind. What you do, you or me, you or I, you put it to any word whichever is correlating with you, you, you get attached with the mind. And what happens? The mind, whatever the mind takes, you are affected. One simple example I tell you. You are in theater. 
a theater or at home watching a movie or a documentary on your laptop a particular scene that affects you you start crying another particular scene that affects you start laughing can you tell me what makes you to cry supposing a scene really it affects you uh, it is a very sad event but you start crying you know what happens you get attached with your mind always we should remember you are different from the mind i am not talking about the philosophy i am talking in terms of psychology in terms of spirituality in terms of emotion and everything you see the mind once you are attached with the mind you take in and then it affects you now coming to the next stage create a vacuum between you and the mind that vacuum will make you accept what you are and to choose whether positive or negative another example i give you one glass you have half glass of water another half glass empty now between two persons there can be a terrible argument day or night you can argue you will never come to sort of consensus if one says the glass is half empty is it true or not another person says the glass is filled with water half glass is filled with water is it true or not if there is a debate who will succeed this is what happens in the world filled with both okay but if you are attached with your mind whatever the mind does you are affected be detached with the mind give a command to your mind either to empty the glass fully or to fill the glass with water it is in you okay this is the basic element okay set aside now come back to next one dear friends there is a wound created the wound can be psychological can be physical and it can be emotional whatever it is you know varieties of hurt the wounds and if it is a physical wound where do you have the wound whether the wound is the wound has affected the nerve or a bone or a flesh or a skin you just to see physical if it is physical it can be a skin it can be a bone it can be a nerve it can be a tissue okay right and there is specialist for each thing even for your right eye there is a specialist left eye to test there is another specialist now we see the skin if the skin is affected the wound to be healed there is a separate process if the bone is affected to heal there is a separate process one example i tell you now go to the next now you see there are four levels of healing one is splint that's the first level of healing another one is the doctor gives you electrical stimulator so that the nerve starts functioning properly or the skin starts vibrating properly and the next one is the physical therapy physiotherapy you call it physical therapy by human touch next one you need exercise in order to heal there are many ways now to bring healing there are also other areas medicine the doctor can heal you nature can heal you god has created everything even in the nature one leaf is enough to heal the deep wound yes or no now we are always in relation to your doctor as specialist 
He is specialized in everything. Yes or no? And who is the doctor? You are wanted. You are wonderstruck. Jesus Christ is the doctor who is specialized in everything. Nothing is left behind. Supposing your bodily organ is wounded, you go to a specialist. Your brain is affected, go to another specialist. Your eye is affected, go to another specialist. But all, all those damages go to only one specialist who can do wonders. Who can do wonders. Who can rectify all the wounds and bring healing. If the skin is affected, to heal it takes minimum four weeks to six weeks. The medicine is applied and all the facilities are given. The circumstances is provided for you in spite of all that it takes four weeks. If it is a deep wound, it takes four to six weeks. But the divine Lord, the physician who can heal you right at the moment, how it is possible. We now quote some of the scriptural words. With that background, we try understand the divine Lord who is a divine physician who can bring healing to all of us invariably the prophet Jeremiah who says chapter 33 verse 6 behold I will bring to it health and healing and I will heal them and reveal to them abundance of prosperity and security Yes, he can bring prosperity and he can also provide security. He can secure you and me from all else, from the rest of this. It is possible. But what is the basic need is the faith, trust in the Lord and keep moving. Abraham did, the prophets did in the Old Testament. They were hesitant in the beginning. The moment they accepted that it is the divine Lord who invites, they accept it. And you can see the enormous amount of success and how they have regained in plentiful. Abraham in today's first trading, he left everything. It was a great damage for him. It was a great loss for him. But what was the gain for him? Father of faith. It is the faith that he has. We don't need to encroach anything else but fill with the faith and your life is affluent. So the divine Lord, again read Psalm 41 verse 3. The Lord sustains him on his sick bed. You don't need to go, to, uh, go anywhere but there are process of doing it. In his illness, you restore him to full health. That is a prayer, supplication we place forward. And you take Psalm 147, verse 3. Someone can read. He heals the broken hearted and binds up their wounds. What sort of wound it is? Psychological, physical, where do you categorize? I am asking you to reflect based on this. What sort of wound from which? Broken hearted, psychological. Psychologically when someone is broken down, the divine Lord becomes a healer. He brings the healing touch and he heals. Proverbs 17, verse 22. A joyful heart is good medicine. The Lord makes you to be joyful. When you entrust yourself under the care of the Lord, when you have faith in Him that He can fund us, and when you trust in the Lord, you see a joyful heart, you become 
a man with joy man or woman with a joyful heart and that is the medicine you receive from the lord again st james chapter 5 verse 15 and the prayer of the faith will save the one who is sick you see the what is the basic medicine the prayer of the faith and the lord will raise him up and if he has committed sins he will be forgiven again the forgiveness is another medicine all sort of various medicines are there within the lord depending on our sickness depending on the wounds depending on the bodily organs it's not only psychological healing physical healing emotional healing all the healings the divine lord does because he is the master of all the doctors praise the lord and so dear brothers and sisters whenever we gather in two or three in his name we gather in his name and be sure we gather in faith and love and trust in the lord and the lord does the wonders when you really entrust under his care total supplication of your mind body say for instance two hours you pray the whole night you pray you read the bible or you listen some to someone who who is a powerful healer physically you are there by mind heart and thought you are not there do you think anything will take place anything will take place any healing will take place yes or no non cooperation detachment from the presence of the lord this is what happened with those people when jesus was able to perform miracles everywhere in many places except in his own hometown what was what was the reason when he went to his hometown they did not listen you know why they made a blockage i do not i do know you the way the way i know you i know in what level i know you you are a carpenter you are carpenter's son you are son of mary we know you are family from where how you were brought up how poor family it is and you are basically a jewish like one among us just to see the way how the human mind considers jesus to the level so the first blockage and the second blockage is faith is removed from that person no faith in the lord why should i listen to you you are one among us faith is blocked and the third one detachment completely even though physically they are there jesus was able to try he was able to do things perform wonders nothing worked in all these three levels so whenever we gather in his name dear brothers and sisters remember it is not enough that we are physically present it's not enough that orally we also matter say some prayers it's not enough our eye contact is there to listen to someone else it's not enough that with eye contact we keep reading the prayer we may shout aloud join together with others and still these three are not there all the three are detached the healing does not take place yes or no and so remember it's not only the physical presence but the trust that has to be there in us secondly the involvement total involvement that the lord will do wonder for me the physician divine physician is there with me and so with a faith and trust i approach the lord involve emotionally the healing takes place not only physically emotionally and all else and so dear brothers and sisters what is the most important is our cooperation to the divine lord our cooperation to the divine lord it's not enough that we remain in the presence of the lord we can remain in the presence of the lord and still we can get detached in everything we can remain in the presence of the lord physically we can be present and still we are not focused there are many ways we make a stumbling fence like that of 
the home town the people of home town we can also make a stumbling fence so let us pray to the lord seeking for his benevolent graces to remove all the fences all the barriers and then straight away we are in touch and contact with the lord with trust the lord will do wonders for us and here i would like to ask you all together stand let's now pray for a healing delivers jesus our loving master let us close our eyes and feel our presence physically in the hall we feel that we are together with the rest of the people we feel that we have come for a purpose to pray to the lord to get united by mind heart and thought by physic by emotion and by everything we have come here with faith and love that the divine lord is going to assist us the divine lord is going to touch us and the divine lord is going to reveal to us yes dear lord jesus we ask of your grace to fill the minds and hearts of everyone gathered here they all gathered in your name and we are your servants we totally keep our minds hearts and thoughts the doors open so that we can receive your blessings in goodness we can receive your healing touch and we become healed from all the wounds in the past bless us lord lead us mold us and guide us as you wish us to follow we make this prayer through christ our lord amen god bless you thank you father so my this so wonderful word you gave it father today and uh, we are truly grateful and thankful and uh, with a uh, beautiful scriptures also very related scriptures and we are really thankful to your father and uh, and um, and now my brothers and sisters we are going to continue with our session and as we are in the presence of god and the wonderful god is here with us hallelujah 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 and this is the time we need to worship the living god and praise his holy name his power is here my brothers and sisters exodus 15:26 the lord says i am your god i am your healer hallelujah. hallelujah and that god is here today to heal us to bind our wounds psalm 147:3 he says he's close to the broken hearted and binds up their wounds hallelujah. hallelujah again the lord says very clearly this is the word in psalm 34:18 he is close to the broken hearted and those who are crushed in the spirit today if you are a crushed in the spirit the god is here to heal you hallelujah so this is the time to worship the lord this is the time to praise god my brother and sister let's lift our hands and praise and worship the lord hallelujah ula ma shila la la ma ma hala ma shila hallelujah we worship you lord we praise you lord we thank you lord we adore you lord hala ma shila la 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 ma ma hala ma shila hallelujah we worship you lord we praise you lord we thank you lord we adore you lord hallelujah we glorify your mighty name ula ma shila la 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 hallelujah 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 Lord you're the living God you're touching your people today Ula ma shila la la ma ma hala ma shila la 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 ma 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 hala ma shila Hallelujah we worship you we praise you we thank you we adore you we glorify your holy name Lord hallelujah The wonderful God is here my brothers and sisters Book of Isaiah 43:10 and 11 the Lord says There is no other God beside me that never was that never will be i alone are the lord who, who can save you my brothers and sisters today we are worshiping the living god that is jesus christ there are millions of gods in the world they have hands that cannot move they have lips but 
they cannot speak their mouth they have eyes they cannot see they have ears they cannot hear but we have a living god who hears every single cry of ours when jesus was in the boat with the disciples of his that's the time there was a tempest he was sleeping in the boat but when the disciples of jesus said and called it oh master wake up don't you care for us jesus got up that very moment and rebuked the wind and the storm stopped my brothers and sisters today there may be so many storms in your life so many problems you must be encountering but do not worry this wonderful living god we can approach any time of the day or any time of the night hallelujah, hallelujah. he is there to solve our problems he is there that's why the lord says Hebrews 13:5 I will never leave you I will never forsake you hallelujah. hallelujah He will never leave us He will never forsake us That's the promise he has given That's what David says very clearly My brothers and sisters this is the words Psalm 9:10 Those who know your name will trust in you Lord and you will never forsake those who seek you So we are all come to seek Jesus today hallelujah So this is the time let's worship the Lord let's praise God and right now right now let's sing this beautiful my brother sing and let's surrender our life into the hands of this wonderful God let's sing together this wonderful worship him and through the cross of Jesus let's sing at the foot of the cross Oh 
My brothers and sisters, we are in the presence of the mighty and powerful God. When the Lord forgives us and a healing takes place, a person, paralyzed person, came to Jesus because he was brought by his friends, maybe a colleagues. And now, Jesus said, My son, your sins are forgiven. At that very moment, the Pharisees, they were angry and upset with Jesus. He's blaspheming God. How can he say, You are forgiven? He's taking the place of God. Jesus said the son of man has authority on earth to forgive sins and heal and he commanded that man take up your mat and walk my brothers and sisters that's very moment that man was healed and took up his mat and walked hallelujah my brothers and sisters, so what happens through this we know. When we repent, when we come back to Jesus and He forgives our sins, a healing takes place. Hallelujah. A healing takes place. Maybe a physical, a spiritual, a emotional or whatever healing there may be you require that takes place so Jesus is here close your eyes for a moment repent for your sins ask forgiveness and talk to him tell him Lord I am sorry I have hurt you I have done things wrong in your sight Lord Jesus, I have rebelled against your commandments. I have whipped you. I have kicked you. I have stripped you. And I have put the blunt nails through your hands and legs. I have made you go through so much pain and suffering by my sinfulness, Lord. I am truly sorry. Please forgive me. Wash me. Cleanse me and purify me at this moment, Lord. I am truly sorry. Ask forgiveness from Jesus. Talk to him. And tell him and repent for your sins. As you're repenting, as you're repenting, a healing comes to you. A healing comes to you. Sincerely repent. Let your mind and heart be upon Jesus. My brothers and sisters, this Lee, Jesus is the divine healer. Jeremiah 37, the Lord said, 
I will restore you to health. I will heal your wounds. There may be so many wounds in your heart today. Our inner wounds. But Jesus has the capacity to heal all your inner wounds. Today surrender your pain, your suffering, your misery, your agony, your fear, your tension, fear of the present, fear of the past, or fear of the future. Whatever area there may be, you surrender to Jesus. He's here to heal you. He's here to cleanse you. So let's say this small prayer of repentance along with me. Repeat after me. Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus I, am a miserable sinner. I am a miserable sinner. I am unworthy, I am unworthy to stand in your holy presence. In your holy presence. Forgive me, Lord Jesus. Me, Lord Jesus. Wash, me Wash me with your precious blood, with your precious blood. and sanctify me Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus I, confess I confess with my mouth, with my mouth and believe in my heart in my that you are my Lord that you are my, that you are my Savior, are my Savior. Send, forth your Holy send forth your Holy Spirit upon me, me and change my life, change my life. Let, me let me not be the same again, be the same again. thank you Jesus, thank you, Jesus. praise you Jesus Hallelujah, hala machine, love of Mahala machine, love of Mahala machine, Ula Mamma Mahala machine, love of Mahala machine, love of Mahala machine, Ula Mamma Mahala machine, love of Mahala machine, Jesus, you are touching your people and healing your people, Ula Mamma Mahala machine, la 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 Mamma Mahala machine, Hallelujah, we worship, we worship, Ula machine, love of Mahala. Hala mashila la 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 ma 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 hala mashila Hallelujah 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 The blood of Jesus has power Hebrews 10:19 says Brethren we can enter the holy of holies through the precious blood of the lamb Yes, my brothers and sisters, we have access to enter the Holy of Holies through the precious blood of the Lamb. His blood cleanses us. That's why Ephesians 1 7 says, His blood cleanses us, His blood purifies us. The shed blood of Jesus, my brothers and sisters, every drop of that blood He shed on the cross. Is a bringing healing to us today. Hallelujah. Every disease in the world has a healing. There's a medicine through the blood of Jesus. Hallelujah. My brothers and sisters, that's why let the blood of Jesus cleanse us and purify us. As we sing this beautiful hymn, it's your blood that cleanses me. Let's sing together. Oh, 
Arthritis be healed in the name of Jesus. Ula mashila, lapa pahala mashila. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Neck pain be healed in the name of Jesus. Ula mashila, lapa pahala mashila. Ula mama mama hala mashila, lapa pahala mashila. Leg pain be healed in the name of Jesus. Right now, Jesus is touching you and healing you. Mashila, every pain, every disease, surrender to Jesus. Right now, His power is moving. Ula mashila, lapa pahala mashila. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Diabetes be healed in the name of Jesus. Liver disease be healed in the name of Jesus. Fatty liver be healed in the name of Jesus. Ula mama mama hala mashila, lapa pahala mashila. Digestion. Problems be healed in the name of Jesus. Ula mashila, lapa pahala mashila. Right now the Lord is touching you. Right now the Lord is healing you. All your and your hand if you are not able to lift Right now the Lord is touching you. The frozen shoulders. Jesus is healing you. Ula mashila lapa pahala mashila. Hallelujah. 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 Ula mashila lapa pahala mashila lapa pahala mashila. Eye pain be healed in the name of Jesus. Ula mama mama hala mashila lapa pahala mashila. All eyesight be healed in the name of Jesus. Ula mama mama hala mashila lapa pahala mashila. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Ear pain and deaf ears open in the name of Jesus. Ula mama mama mahala mashila la 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 mama mama hala mashila. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Cough, cold and fever be healed in the name of Jesus. Ula mashila la ba ba hala mashila. Hallelujah. If there's a lung infection, be healed in the name of Jesus. Ula mama mama hala mashila la 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 dementia be healed in the name of Jesus. Ula mama mama ma any heart disease, any heart blocked arteries for the heart be open in the name of Jesus. Ula mama mama hala mashila. Lord is touching you and healing you. Ula mama mama ma hala mashila la 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 la. Uterus be healed in the name of Jesus. If there is a conceiving problem, be healed in the name of Jesus. Ula mama mama ma hala mashila la 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 ma 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 hala mashila. Jesus is touching and healing you. Ula mama mama hala mashila la 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 la. Hallelujah, Hallelujah. Right now, His power is moving upon you. He is healing your pain. Ula mama mama hala mashila la 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 la. The skin disease be healed in the name of Jesus. Ula mama mama hala mashila la ba ba hala ma. Back pain be healed in the name of Jesus. Ula mama mama hala mashila la 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 mama mama hala mashila. Any bone related problem or pain in your bones or nerves be healed in the name of Jesus. If in a weakness in your body be healed in the name of Jesus. Ula mashila la 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 mama mama hala mashila. Hallelujah, 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 Hallelujah. All if there's excess blood flow. Be healed in the name of Jesus. Ula mama mama hala mashila la 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 ba 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 hala mashila. 
Jesus is touching you and healing you. Ula mama hala ma shila la 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 mama hala ma shila. Every pain in the body be gone in the name of Jesus. Be gone in the name of Jesus. Ula mama mama hala ma shila. Hallelujah. We worship you. We praise you. We thank you. We adore you. Right now, I pray for your deliverance, my brothers and sisters. In the mighty and powerful name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, right now, I'm going to lift a prayer for your deliverance. If you are any kind of a bondages, right now, in the name of Jesus, you'll be set free. In the name of Jesus, you'll be said, go on praising them. When you're praising God, deliverance takes place. Ula Mashila, lift your hearts and breath and lift your minds and lift your voices and praise God. Hi, lift your voices high, powerfully and then deliverance takes place. In the mighty and powerful name of Jesus, in the mighty and powerful name of Jesus, every one of you in the bondage, if you're in the bondage of pornography, set free in the name of Jesus Ula Mashila Lababa Hala Mashila in the mighty and powerful name of Jesus Christ if you're in the bondage of alcoholism you'll be set free in the name of Jesus if you're in the bondage of smoking any kind of a drug addiction or in the bondage of any kind of addiction right you'll be set free in the name of Jesus Ula Mama Mama Mahala Mashila Lababa Hala Mashila right now if you're a bondage of anger hatred bitterness jealousy you be set free in the name of Jesus if you're in the body of unforgiveness you be set free in the name of Jesus Ula Mashila if you're in the body of cheating or lying or any kind of a wickedness you be set free in the name of Jesus right now the Lord is setting you free because he is the mighty deliverer. Ula mama mama mahala mashila. If you are watching any kind of blue films or X-rated films, you be set free in the name of Jesus. Ula mama mama mahala mashila. If you have visited any of the uh, pagan temples or carrying anything of the lakka charm on your body, right now you be set free in the name of Jesus. He is touching you and healing you, delivering you. Ula mama mama mahala mashila. If you are involved in any kind of for occult, you be set free in the name of Jesus. Ula mama mama hala ma shila la 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 mama ma. If you are gone to any witchcraft people, you be set free in the name of Jesus. Ula mama mama hala ma shila. Hallelujah, 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 Hallelujah. Right now, sing the beautiful Holy Spirit and invite the Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. Ula ba 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 
This is the time the Lord is touching you and healing you, my brothers and sisters. Hallelujah. 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 Yeah. The Lord and uh, especially I want to ask you, if any of you are felt the joy of the Spirit today, you can lift your hands today. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Let's give a big hand to the Lord. Hallelujah. 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 If any of you felt the touch today of the, maybe you had a pain in your body, and uh, you came with a very the heart today because of that particular pain, maybe a uh, headache or body pain or any pain in your body. Now you are feeling relieved. You know, can you lift your hands? Can you lift your hands? All people who have been healed and touched, can you lift your hands a little higher, please? Yes. There are many people out there right now here. One, two, three, four. And I saw some of you keep lifting up. Uh, five, six, seven. And uh, there are people, I saw somebody, yeah, eight, yeah. Okay, nearly eight people, they had the pain relieved and the Lord touched them in a special way. Shall we give a big hand to the Lord? Hallelujah. 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 So God is doing a wonderful things, my brothers and sisters. You know, so God is healing you. Lord is touching you in a special way. This time you need to call other people also to this prayer session. Isn't it? Hallelujah. We need to... Be the, what? The fishes of men. You know, that's where Matthew 4, 18 to 19, that Jesus said to the disciples, I will make you, now onwards, I will make you, what? Fishes of men. Hallelujah. You also need to be that. Hallelujah. So my brother, call your friends, call your relatives, evangelize. I'm sure Hallelujah. God is going to bless you. All those now my brother and sister, would you like to sing a beautiful final song? Hallelujah. Shall we join in? All get together and sing this beautiful hymn, my brothers and sisters. It is good, it is good, it is good to give thanks to the Lord on high. Sing of your faithfulness and loving kindness both day and night. Play on our instruments, sweet songs of praise for the things you do. It is good, it is good, it is good to give thanks to you. Although we struggle in trials and troubles still come our way. You won't us. You told us your promises will never end. Sing it again, it is good, it is good, it is good to give thanks to the Lord on high. Sing of your faithfulness and loving kindness both day and night. To play on our instruments, sweet songs of praise for the things you do. It is good, it is good, it is good to give thanks to you. It is good, it is good, it is good to give thanks to you. It is good, it is good, it is good to give thanks to you. Shall we give a big hand to the Lord? Hallelujah.